Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Michelle, and today, as you can tell by the title of the video, I'm going to be showing you my current favorite ab exercises. And let me tell you that they haven't changed that much in the last few months. I've been really sticking to this style of ab workout. But before we get into the video, let me give you a little tip. I hit lower abs mainly. Always start with lower abs because I mean, most people don't carry that much fat around their upper abs. But if you got fat all over your body that you need to get rid of, doing ab work isn't gonna spot reduce. You need to have a clean eating lifestyle and do consistent workouts to see your body fat percentage go down all over. And then we can start really zoning in on working your abs a little bit harder. And I can't lie to you. I can't lie. I hate, hate doing ab exercises. So, for the last few months I've been telling myself to do more abs, but realistically I've been hitting maybe two exercises once a week and I usually just add them on to like an arm day or something. Moving forward, this was week one, I did a full ab workout. Let me tell ya that my abs are really sore. They are really sore. And so I know I did something good. So do this workout if you want to totally destroy your abs. But if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe so then you don't miss another workout with me. I have so much on the works. I'll be doing many more videos like this. I'll be doing food tips and tricks. I'll be doing all sorts of fitness hacks. Like the video so other people can come and train their abs with me and you. Oh, hello there. I see you. All right, so the first move in the superset is a knee tap, a plank knee tap. When I bring my knees down, I really make sure to activate my core. So with my belly button, you kind of see it kind of go in towards my back as I lower my knees. And then without a break, I go right into this Pilates inspired move. It's like a snow angel to sit up. If you have lower back problems, do not come up, stay down and just bring the knees into the chest. You can do one leg at a time or you can totally lower the legs as well for different options. If you feel this in your lower back or any ab exercises, you need to stop and not do it. It means your abs aren't strong enough or your technique's off. And then I came over here to a little circuit. I did three moves in a row. So the first one is one I've been loving. I feel like it gets super deep within the core. So it's like a pullover and a leg raise all at the same time. Here what I'm making sure I do is I push down on my low back. Like you don't want to see any holes between the bench and your low back. You can also do this on the floor so you don't go as deep. want to pull down through the belly button at the hardest point. So right there, I am trying to pull in versus letting my abs just stick out. Then I go right into a butt up. I try to control my legs and I try to go straight up. Notice how I'm not just letting my knees come into my chest. I'm trying to go straight up, control on the way up and down. These burn. And then I grab the weight and I go right into the last move, which is a toe touch with the weight. So it makes it a little bit more challenging. Same thing here, suck in through the stomach right now. And make sure that your legs are over your hips so there's no strain in your lower back. Good luck. Final exercise, I go into the Roman chair leg raises. These will totally, if your lower abs aren't sore yet, this will guarantee that they will get there. So I go straight leg first, as many as you can, and then bent knee, same thing. You can either do these on the floor if you don't have this machine, or hanging from like a bar. Oh, sexy abs, here we come.
All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Go try those out. I promise it's harder than it looks. Remember though, don't you don't want to overtrain your abs because it's going to create bulk. It's just like a muscle. You don't want it to grow too much because we're trying to keep it nice and tight. So just a little bit, a little bit. Don't train them more than once a week. Okay, that's my tip for today. Bye.